homework, interviews, classes, exams, stress, bam. College, it slaps you in the face, then kicks you in the stomach, and then steals your lunch money like Jason did to me in the third grade. Hey Jason. Stress has many negative effects on your health, mood, and behavior. People manage stress in different ways. Sports, media, and yoga. And for many of us, memes. But is there a better way to be less stressed? Like a big buff anti-stress coach? Relax, stop being stressed. Or what about a personal fan club that cheers you on wherever you go? It's him. Situation. Nope, it's gratitude. What? Gratitude? That's right, gratitude. Researchers from the NAH studied blood flow in various brain regions while subjects summoned up feelings of gratitude. They found that subjects who showed more gratitude overall had higher levels of activity in the hypothalamus, which has a huge influence on your metabolism and stress levels. Subjects who showed more gratitude directly activated brain regions associated with the neurotransmitter dopamine, which is a reward neurotransmitter that initiates positive reinforcements rather than wasting your time stressing about things. Whew. You got all that? Great. Neither did I. Basically, your brain can only hold so many thoughts and emotions at once, and gratitude is the key to crowding out stress. So, the next time you're stressed, consider gratitude. Thanks. So, the next time you're stressed. So, the next time you're stressed. So, the next time you're stressed. Consider gr- Oh no! <laughs> ah!